quick setup guide for Extron-based active learning classroom. The CSUOB active learning classrooms are flexible student-centered learning environments. ALCs allow instructors to actively engage their students and facilitate peer review within small groups. The features and table arrangements in the ALCs may vary slightly depending on the room, but the equipment in the classrooms may include the following. An instructor station, which may consist of a PC, a touch panel, mobile device, audiovisual input connections, document camera, DVD and Blu-ray player, wireless microphone system, etc. Approximately eight student tables, which each consist of a PC, a large LCD monitor, an audiovisual controller, and mobile device input connections. A pair of projectors, each located on the opposite ends of the room. Getting started. This section will describe how to power the system on and connect your mobile devices. Powering on the system. Wake the touch panel, aka classroom controls console, which is located at the instructor station by waving your hand in front of the screen. Next, touch the start button on the screen. If using the instructor computer, wake the computer by moving the mouse or pressing a key on the keyboard. If it does not respond, try powering it on by pressing the computer's power button located inside of the cabinet. The computer's power status indicator light, which is located on or next to the power button, should be illuminated, indicating that the computer is powered on. If using a mobile device, connect the corresponding display cable from the cable cubby, for example the laptop VGA, into your device. Connect the audio cable into the 3.5 millimeter audio jack of your device for audio playback. If using the document camera, press the power button located on the document camera's base. You should see the power button status indicator light solid green, indicating that the device is powered on and ready for use. TouchLink Touch Panel Overview The TouchLink Touch Panel is your interface to control all devices in the room. The top panel contains source locations. The left panel contains microphone volume controls and system off button. The display area changes to display selected control pages. The right panel contains speaker volume, video mute, and local source controls. The bottom panel displays the system's date and time. The fundamentals for broadcasting images is 1. Select a source 2. Select a device 3. Select destinations. Tap on instructor station. Select a source. Select which display you want to send the content to. For example, step 1, tap on instructor station. Step 2, select the VGA connection. And step 3, send to all projectors. Step 1, select a table which has a device you want to project from. Step 2, select a source. Step 3, select which display you want to send the content to. For example, step 1, select table 4. Step 2, select PC. And step 3, send to projector and all TVs. When you are done, as you are wrapping up your class session, please do the following. Press the system off button on the touch panel and confirm your selection. Turn the document camera off by pressing the power button twice. Clean the walls of any marker work. Log off from the instructor station and all student station computers. Refer to the following resources to get more ALC-related software and support information.